<laughs> I'm Hi. Bidu. Hi, I'm Alton. <laughs> nice to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you too. Uh, where do you come from? Uh, I come from India, a South Indian city called Chennai. Oh, yeah. I've been there. You have? Yeah. Where are you from? I'm from Sri Lanka, oh, okay. uh, but I was born in Norway. Have you always wanted to become a doctor? Why did you choose medicine? I've always wanted to become a doctor, but I think at first I wanted to become a doctor because my parents told me. Okay. And after I grew up or like got older, I think uh, I you like did some research and I found out yeah I really want to become a doctor. Okay. And did you always know that you want to become a doctor? Mm, actually no. I I wanted to do a lot of different things, you know. I wanted to do art, I wanted to do singing, I oh. wanted to write poems. But in the end, you know, I thought doctors like becoming a doctor was the best thing for me. Hmm. In terms of medicine and you know, I just felt like it was the best way to do service for people and also get involved politically and make changes in the world. Do you think you can improve healthcare in your own country and how do you think you can do that? That's a really good question. Um, I think I can. I think uh, like I think it's good that I'm studying abroad because I think you can grab a lot of different knowledge. Every person do have different knowledge and learn in different ways. So I think like I can add something to my own country. But I don't know what exactly I want to change because I think the health policy in Norway is good. <laughs> yeah. Where well, um, I'm from India, so there is a lot of issues surrounding the health care policies there. Mm. Not only because it's privatized, but also because the administration of the public sector is a bit, you know, one of the main things I want to personally do is to like introduce more uh, stringent adolescent health laws, you know, make educational reforms mm. so that that would directly affect health. So, you know, improving sexual education and making people more aware about, you know, use of contraception and safety, yeah. that would really affect the health of the people itself. So that's something that I would like to change. Uh, have anything changed in your perception of medical university or would in general? Yeah, I think um, since I came here, I was, you know, expecting an even bigger city <laughs> because I'm used to like bigger cities like, you know, I'm from Chennai and I used to live in London. But then like I love the fact that it's, you know, uh, not as huge as I expected it to be. It's actually so nice and quaint and like, you know, there's a lot of things to do, but it's not so busy and like it's, it's a nice city to live in. And yeah, so my perceptions have changed. And actually, even like in the first two weeks of coming here, when I saw the big mural down at the um, CKD building, yeah, yeah. I was like, wow, this you know, piece of art in the building, like, I was like impressed. And then yeah. when I go around town, I see like different murals all over town, mm. all the different you know, paintings and graffitis. And I'm like, this is a really artistic city. People are really involved. They're making you know, huge pieces of art and they're putting it on display in the public. So I was like, yeah, I'm really impressed. I want to explore more. And so I, you know, sometimes go to art galleries, you know, museums to key and like, oh. you know, all of that. So I just feel like I've grown to like the city more. I've grown with the city. And so obviously I do like and enjoy it a lot, lot more than I did when I first came here. That's good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> well, goodbye. It nice was to nice meet you. to get to know you. Take Bye. Care. Bye. <laughs>